low. Hello, Gloria. Gloria, can you hear me? Hello, Victor, how are you? Can you hear me, guys? Victor, Gloria. Can you hear me? Let me see if I can do something here. Can you hear me? Victor, can you hear me? Hello, Gloria. Gloria. There's something going on here. Hello, Gloria. Hola, hola. Victor. Victor, me escucha? Hola. Víctor, ¿me escucha? Víctor. Hoy sí. Ah, hoy sí. Qué bueno. Ya me estaba preocupando. <laughs> Gloria, can you hear me? Yes. Hoy sí. Ok, Gloria. Gloria parece que tiene problemitas también. Ah, sí, así me, me estaba viendo yo. Uy, qué raro es. Sí, no les escuchaba. Ya estaba por ponerme los otros audífonos que me queman las orejas. No, aquí me porque tenía los, los de Bluetooth, pero me filtraba error y error en el micrófono. Entonces, no. Ah, no ok. Puede. Gloria, can you hear us? Creo que está teniendo problemas. Gloria, Rebeca, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. Good, great. Did you complete the exercises? Eh, sí, teacher, en, por la sección uno terminada. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, do you have any question? Eh, tengo acá con una pregunta de la 1.11. No sé si vio la foto de la última eh, donde dice not every well actualist no supe qué pregunta era porque chip y gpi no estoy segura qué significa porque a mí me da como resultado tipo entonces le puse how go every you at pero no es respuesta correcta e intenté también con how well parece que es el otro how will algo así y, pero tampoco Entonces no sé en qué me estaré equivocando yo ahí, no. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Sí. Quiero uh -huh. ver. ¿Qué número me dice que es? En la sección 1.11, el último, el 4. Está bastante lento esto. Bueno. 1.12, este me dice. 1.11. Ah, es este el anterior, entonces. Uh -huh. Este. Sí, ese. ¿Qué número? Completa la siguiente pregunta, guíese por las respuestas. El 4, type. Ajá. Sí, ese, teacher. Mm. 
Not very well. Mm -hmm. How, aquí está, um, estamos con lo de las preguntas con how. Uh -huh. En esta parte son preguntas con how. Uh -huh. Puede ser, como la respuesta dice, not very well. Actually, I need to take a typing class. Uh -huh. How and type, vamos a ver. Esa es la clase que vamos a ver ahora, las preguntas con how. Aquí, uh -huh. hay varias formas de hacer estas preguntas. O sea, el how se puede utilizar para hacer diferentes preguntas. Ok, how well, puede ser how well do you type? How do well. Uh -huh. How do Probó así. Sí. Le puse how well do you, pero ahí es T O O A T. Aquí tengo que hacer la pregunta, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. ¿Así? Ajá. Uh -huh. Lo probó a hacerlo así. Sí, así eh, lo hice, sí. ¿Lo voy a hacerlo así completa? Completa no, no he intentado. Como está ahí la componente, no lo dejaría pasar completa tampoco. Ajá. No le da bien así. How no. well do you type? No, ha intentado how well y el how s que he escrito. Y no la agarra, me parece extraño. Quizás es algún problemita acá que no, no está reconociendo. Vamos a intentar, lo voy a seguir intentando y les comento a ver cómo me va. Ok, teacher. Porque según lo que está en el contenido, debería de darnos bien la respuesta. How well do you type? Que también digitas. O puede okay. ser how fast. Pero no, no lo creo. Voy a intentar hacerlo más tarde y les comento a ver cómo me va. Ok, teacher. Uh -huh. Gloria, ¿cómo va? Ya, ya completó. Hi, eh, eh, ayer entré a la plataforma y sube, comencé a completar algunos ejercicios. Uh -huh. Ok, very nice. Okay. Hubo problemas con alguno. ¿Hizo ese mismo que está haciendo Rebeca? No, a ese no llegué. ¿Usted, Víctor? No, teacher. Uh... Ya cuando vamos a la mitad, nos sentamos a hacer las preguntas. Ahorita todavía no. Hay que esperar uh -huh. que pase la semana de clase. Ok. Mañana, o el viernes. Ya <risa> sabe que nos juntamos y estamos ahí. Va de mayor sitio. Sí, sí. Vamos a tratar de ayudarle a Rebeca con este ejercicio porque me parece extraño que no esté agarrando la respuesta a la plataforma. A mí así me pasó en un módulo, se recuerda que le ponía le ponía y no me agarraba. Así, mm. Así lo tuvo que dejar, ¿verdad? Sí recuerdo que intentamos por todos los medios de arreglarla y no, no pudimos. Ok, so, uh, for this lesson, let's talk about this. Asking and answering these questions, this is just to practice speaking. Uh, let's see, Gloria, who's your favorite male athlete? Who's your favorite male athlete? Uh, in my case, my favorite male athlete is uh, soccer. Okay, the athlete, el atleta. Ah, okay. Uh, Who's your favorite male athlete? 
Okay, my favorite male athlete uh, is Ronaldo. Ronaldo is a soccer player, right? Yeah. Why? Uh, because I think he's a good uh, soccer player. So uh, you like soccer? Yeah. Okay, great. Uh, who's your favorite female athlete? Oh, uh, I don't have a female athlete teacher. Ah, really? Okay. Yeah. I don't, uh, I usually don't uh, watch uh, a sport. Sport, ah, okay. Well, um, who are three famous athletes in our country? Oh, only who are I three famous athletes in our country? Mm, I oh. remember Eva I Maria remember. Dimas. Eva Maria Dima, exactly. And Cristina, I don't remember the last name, but Cristina is a. Uh, no. I, I think that she, she, um, she rides a bike. No. No. Or lift weights. It's a great. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And another? Oh, only, only. Okay. Ask one of these questions to one of your classmates. You can ask Ricardo, Rebecca, Guadalupe, Joan. Ask one question to one classmate. Okay. We have many questions here. Lo voy a cambiar. Lo voy a cambiar. Ask one question, Gloria. Okay. Eh, um, what eh, sport or activity do you eh, want to try? Who? Ricardo, Rebecca. Victor, Joan, yeah. Guadalupe. Oh, Victor. Victor. What sport or activity do you want to try? I am. Um, what? Uh, what sport or activity do you want to try? The last question. Um, a sport activity that you want to try is a. Uh, Baseball. Oh, okay. Interesting. Now ask one question to another classmate, Victor. No, ¿cómo se llama el señor de los lentes? Espera, voy a ver los nombres. Joan. Ah, este Ricardo. Vamos a ver. <risa> 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 Okay. Ricardo has no classes to teacher. Oh. Hi, Ricardo. Really? Hi. What's your favorite sport team? Why? Uh, my favorite team is uh, Barcelona Football Club. Why? Uh, why well, is it's a it's a big because it's a big, big, big. Por qué? because yes. it's a big team because I think it's the best team. Ah, okay, because it's a big team. It's, it's, they are great. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a yeah, great no, sir. it's a great team. Ah, okay. 
Now, ask another question to another classmate, Ricardo. Uh, Juan Ismael. Hello. Oh. And the question? Uh, is correct. Uh, why were you favorite activity? What is my favorite activity? Sport. Uh, my favorite activity is play soccer and ride bikes because it's good for the for the breath, for the body. Okay, good. Continue. Ask another classmate. Okay, to Gloria Navarro. Okay. What's, oh, let me check. Do you ever watch sports live? Which ones? Oh. Hello? Yes, Gloria, we can Hello. hear you. Okay. Uh, I, I watch uh, the soccer on TV. Uh, only I watch uh, an uh, Europa team. Okay. Teacher, how do you say Europa in English? Europe. 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 Okay, thank you. Okay. What? Um, then we have a conversation. Look at the topic. He said, I'm a real fitness freak. No, era, era, era. He's a real fitness freak. Uh huh. I'm a real fitness freak. freak. Okay, freak. Uh huh. I'm a real fitness freak. I'm a real fitness freak. Marina Finis. Okay, look at this guy. He's very muscular. He is a real fitness freak. I am a real fitness freak. Okay, let's practice this conversation. You're great shape, Kate. You're great shape, Kate. Thanks. I'm, I guess I'm a real fitness freak. Thanks. I guess I'm a real I business, a real business freak. freak. How often do you work out? How often do you work out? Oh. Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Tennis and sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Oh, oh do you want to play sometime? Want to play sometime? Uh, how well do you play? Oh, how, how well, well do you play? play? Really well, I guess. Pretty, Pretty well, well, I, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. Well, well I, I try, but I'm not very good. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. No problem. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. Mm -hmm. Any question regarding the vocabulary? Yes, teacher. Fitness freak. Fitness freak. Ese fitness freak es como un aficionado, demasiado aficionado a, a, a en estar en forma. Uh -huh. ah, okay. eh, se pasa como de aficionado ahí a parecer como loco, muy raro. Uh -huh. <risa> Eso es un freak, una persona. Obsesionada. Como... Uh -huh. yeah. uh -huh. En este caso con los ejercicios. Uh -huh. Ok. Thank you. Any other question? Another question? No, 
Shape. Shape. Shape es mm -hmm. forma. Okay. Ajá, forma. La palabra freak se puede utilizar como decir a una persona anormal. Alguien que no es normal, que es raro en algún sentido, es freak. Okay. Ajá. Un fenómeno. Freak. <laughs> yes. Another question? In teacher, I'm free, pero no se puede catalogar como una enfermedad, ¿o sí? No. Mm, lo pueden usar despectivamente, sí. Ay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Depende en qué forma lo digan, puede ser despectivo. Uh -huh. Ok. Será sarcástico de aquí en adelante. Uh -huh. <risa> Freak. Uh -huh. Freak. 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 Uh -huh. Okay, uh, volunteers to role play the conversation. Yo. Okay, Victor mm -hmm. and Ricardo. Okay, okay. Victor. Your, your English. You're in great shape, Kate. You're in great shape, Kate. You're in great shape. You're in great shape, Kate. You're in great shape. You're in great shape, Kate. Repeat. Okay, Victor. You're in great shape, Kate. Thanks, I guess I am a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Then, not long. Like a lot of up song. Fun. 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 How do you fun. want to fun? Oh, fun. Oh, fun. Oh, do you want do you want to play sometime? Ooh, how well do you play? Very well, I guess. Well, I really bad. I am not very good. No problem. I give you a few tips. Okay, very good. Uh, now another two volunteers, maybe Gloria and Joan. Okay. Okay. Okay, you're a star, Gloria. Okay. You're in a grip shape, grip shape, okay? Great, great, great shape. Okay, you're in great shape, okay? Fans, I guess. I am a real fitness freak. Freak. How often do you work out? Well, I'll do aerobics twice a week, and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Hmm, how well do you play? <coughs> Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. Okay, great. Uh, who's missing? Guadalupe. Okay, teacher. I have Guadalupe and Rebecca, I think. Okay, teacher. Okay. Um, Star. You are. No veo la imagen, teacher. Really? Y los demás si la ven. Yes, teacher. Yes. Ah, okay, yeah. Yo que yo yo hay in great Kate Kate in great shape Kate Kate okay. you are great Kate okay. Thanks I guess I am a really finished friends 
fitness freak. Fitness freaks. How often do you go out? Well, do you aerobics? Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Well, do I do aerobics tennis a week? Twice a I, week. Uh, twice a week. I I, I play tennis every week. Tennis? That's so like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Mm, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, I read. Do well, you... all right. Well, all right. Well, uh, all right. All right. But I know very good. No problem. I hearing you. I fix it. A few tips. A few sticks. A few tips. A few sticks. Okay. Well, now uh, the the topic for this um, is also about how to make questions with the word how. Let's see. I have here some material. I need to. Okay. Okay. Um, this is. Can you do uh, more? Can you do more soon, teacher? I will try. Okay. Mm. Plus, 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 plus. Oh, open the here, teacher. Like that. Maxi maximize. Add. Question one. At the right, teacher. At the right. Yes. Here. <laughs> no, no, uh, the other. Yes, this one. Ahí está Máximo. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good, teacher. No more. Okay. It says that. Um, well, how is a very common word to make questions? Question I, more. How yes, how. Mm -hmm. How can I use how? How is a very useful question word. It can be used, like for example, can you read this question, Ricardo? How can, how can I stay I healthy? Healthy. 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 How can I stay healthy? Okay. In this case, um, the this question is asking about a method. Uh -huh. Cuando se quiere saber un método o la forma de hacer algo, usamos how. 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 And you can answer in this way. Can you read the answer, Gloria? Okay. Um, you can stay healthy. You can, you can stay healthy by exercising. Exercising. <laughs> by, exercising. By eating well. Eating. Eating well. Eating well. By eating well. By and by getting enough sleep. Uh-huh, okay. So we use how to ask about a method. Let's read this one, um, Joan. Okay. How do you use a public bus? Mm -hmm. First, you need to buy a ticket. Then you wait at the bus stop. When the bus comes, you put your ticket in the machine next to the driver. The driver will give you a transfer. When you want to get off the bus, pull the car. Finally, remember to thank the driver. Okay. So in this case, it's asking about uh, the way how to do something, right? 
Let's read this one, Ricardo. How far is it to your house? Uh -huh. How far is it to your house? In this case, this is how plus adjective. Mm -hmm. In this case, we use the word how and the adjective is far. Okay. It's asking you to say, is to say the quantity of the adjective. En ese caso, el how es para preguntar o pa, para decir la cantidad de, del adjetivo. En este caso es como decir qué tan lejos. How far. How far. Si le dice qué How tan near. bueno. Qué tan bueno. How good. How good. Ajá. Uh -huh. How good. Así sería qué tan bueno. Tan cerca. How, how, how near. Ajá. Uh -huh. how, how, how close. How close. How close. Mm -hmm. More. Mm -hmm. More. Mm -hmm. And okay. it's five mil. It's a mile and a half. Uh, you see another example with how plus adjective. How big is, is your room? room? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How big? So in this case, it's para preguntar qué tanto, um, cuál yeah. es la magnitud de, del adjetivo, verdad? Qué tan grande, qué tan lejos, qué tan cerca, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. qué tan, qué tan dulce. Uh -huh. how, mm, how, how sweet can uh, how sweet. Mm -hmm. how sweet. Okay. How spicy, right? How can you spicy. see that example? How spicy is the food at that restaurant? Yes. How spicy is the Chinese food? It's really a spicy. What well, Viet, uh, Vietnamese food is really spicy. A Thai food. Thai food is really spicy. Uh -huh. In this case, the adjective is spicy. In the restaurant. How plus adjective and then um, you can ask the same type of question with an adverb. For example, can you read the example, Guadalupe? How quickly? How okay. quickly? Quickly. How quickly do you learn new vocabulary word? Aha, uh -huh. how quickly? Ahí el uh, adverb es quickly. Quickly. Aha, uh -huh. que tan rápido. Tan rápido. Aha, uh -huh. how? I'm learn very slowly. I learn very slow. Okay. I learn very quickly. I don't learn them very quickly. Uh -huh. I don't learn them very quickly. Mm -hmm. Let's see this other one. Victor, can you read this one? How long does it take to hear? To get. get. How long get. does it take to get to your job each day? Uh -huh. How long does it take to get to your job in each day, right? How long mm -hmm. does it take to plus verb is okay. asking about the amount of time. Cuando usted mm -hmm. quiera saber la cantidad de tiempo, pregunta how long. How long. How long does it take to? Esa es la, la frase completa para empezar la pregunta. Cuando usted quiere saber la, la cantidad de tiempo. ¿Cuánto te toma? ¿Cuánto tiempo te toma? Uh -huh. How long does it take to? Luego el verbo. To, to get. Um, to cook, for example. How long does it take to cook um, an apple pie? An apple pie. Uh -huh. How long does it take to prepare a... Uh, Turkey your for class. Christmas. How long does it take to prepare your class? Mm -hmm. ¿Cuánto tiempo te toma? Eh, después del how long does it take to? How long does it take to? Ahí hmm. pueden um, un verbo. Eso es para cuando usted quiera saber la cantidad de tiempo que algo se toma, right? Um, mm -hmm. And you can answer, se puede contestar en esta forma, it 
takes take us an hour. It takes an hour. It takes 20 minutes. 20 it minutes. takes five minutes. It takes five minutes. How long does it take? Wow, that's <laughs> how long does it take to speak English like a native speaker? It takes years. It takes a long time. It takes many months. It takes a lot of practice. <laughs> Okay. It takes many nights. <laughs> many, many nights. <laughs> How much does it cost to buy a house? Many sleepless yes. nights. Okay. How much does it cost to buy a house, house in your city? In city? How much does it cost to, plus Bert is birds. asking about the amount of money needed to buy something. You could answer. How you could answer, Rebecca? It cost half a million dollars. It cost half oh, half, half a million dollars. Million dollar. Uh -huh. Esta cuesta. So you can answer. It cost. It cost five a million dollars. Okay. Cost. Okay. This is an idiom. Yeah. In Spanish, we said, te cuesta un ojo de la cara. Uh -huh. But in English, you say, it costs uh -huh. an uh -huh. arm uh -huh. and a leg. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eso uh -huh. quiere decir que cuesta demasiado dinero. It costs an arm and a leg. And uh -huh. I? Teacher. Yes? Sorry. Uh, what is the what is the meaning half? Half. 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 Mitad. Yeah. Mitad. Mm -hmm. La mitad o, mitad o medio. Si oh. es half million, es medio millón. Ah, okay. Half an hour, media hora. Half past. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's see. Uh, now, how many or how much is asking about quantity of a noun, right? Mm -hmm. How many? How, how many, many or how much? Like, for example, we have the question, how many people do you know who can speak English? How many people do you know who can speak English? Está preguntando por cantidad. Mm -hmm. How much and how many? When do we use how many? Do you remember? How many is a countable? Yes. It's plural. It's a plural. And how much? Non-countable. Yes. Okay. Yes, that's it. For example, that uncountable, fun. How much mm. fun do you have each day? How much fun do you have each day? Ah, okay. uh -huh. How much fun do you have each day? Mm. You could answer, I have a lot have of a fun. Lot. I, have I, a have a I have a little. I have a little. I have a bit. I have a bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. How much? Okay. How, how much, much is uncountable? Uh, well, how much do you exercise? Mm -hmm. It's uncountable. 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 How many? Okay. When he says, how much do you plus a verb ask about the quantity of a verb? For example, if a verb here is exercise, is asking me about the quantity of exercise. That's it. How much do you and the bird? How much do you exercise? How much do you eat at night? Mm -hmm. How much do you eat? How much do you drink? Watch TV. How much do you watch you TV? Uh-huh. 
And okay. then I dream, I dream about two glasses of hot cola. They worked. Okay, this is just to, to know and to remember the different uses of the word how and the conversation with how. Let's uh, see in the platform, you see something else? The question, questions with how. Questions with how and short answers, okay? How often is to know what? How when we is. ask how often is what? The time. Mm, frequency. Of, frequency, okay, frequency. The number of times that you yeah. do something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you use how long? Time. Aha, uh -huh, we are asking about time. For mm -hmm. example, how well? Uh, la cantidad del adjetivo del que se está preguntando, ¿verdad? En este caso, mm -hmm. el adjetivo es well. Mm -hmm. well. Quiero saber en cantidad que también, how well. Mm -hmm. It's the same with how good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How well or how good. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, um, teacher, about this, uh, in the platform, we have a exercise, a pretty quiz. It's 11.1, no, 1.11. I think, uh, I don't know what is the exercise for. The uh, question: can You, how you uh, can you do it, or can you read it uh, for tomorrow? The quiz okay. and one point eleven, the last one. Intentamos hacerlo, pero um, mm. déjeme ver si todavía estoy en. Ay, creo que esta es la página. Uh -huh. Ahí la tiene un costado, Tichu. El 11 de atrás. Ahí. Este es el 1.12, ¿verdad? Sí, el 11 es el de... 1.11. Es este. Era este, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. The last one. Ok, aquí no sé si me las puso malas porque toda, eh, solo quise hacer la última. Pero en la última habíamos intentado con How, how well, well do you? Do you type? Do you type? Er, erase type and the erase type and the question mark. Yes. It's, uh, how well do you type? I think it's the best question. En esta me dijo. Yes. But if you send, you uh, type the, 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 the platform don't, don't, uh, without space. Erase the space, no, no, erase the space. Yes. <coughs> I, think, I think this is the best uh, questions because mm -hmm. the answer is not very well. Um, I don't know what is the best question. Because number three is how long do you, how long do you play cars? The number three, a type. <laughs> Mm 
Mm. Ya, ya probé de todas las formas que podía hacer y creo que es de este ejercicio como el que le tocó a Víctor la vez pasada. Uh -huh. Es que a veces la plataforma más lo confunde aún. Uh -huh. no. Sí, porque aquí ya tenemos todas las opciones según, según nos aparece en la gramática y en el libro y no nos está agarrando ninguna. Uh -huh. Y a todos les dio el mismo problema, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. I think this is the best question, ¿no? Sí, sí, esa correct. sería la respuesta. How well do you type? Es que How también. Well do you type? Mm -hmm. Ajá, pero. By, by the answer. Por la respuesta. Ajá, esa es la opción, la mejor opción que tienen, pero por alguna razón la plataforma no la reconoce en ningún tipo. Um, en esto vamos mm. a tener paciencia y este. A ver si nos la reconoce otro día. Dejemos el ejercicio <risa> pendiente porque uh -huh. sí, o sea, la respuesta es correcta, pero por yes. alguna razón no la reconoce la plataforma. Siempre hay problemitas así en esto. Sí, Vamos a dejar llegar al 10, ¿sí? <risa> al igual en la sección 1.13, eh, aparece ahí el lapicito, como le decía. Y también aparece enviar, entonces yo pensé que también había de que... No, en esta creo que no se puede enviar porque no te deja editar, no te deja escribir. Ajá, ah, sí. Esa es una... Uh, eso solo estaba... Es, ese solo es un... Solo para, para leer. leer y dice que es un, un quiz, pero así aparece en el libro. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ajá, este es como... Um, help quiz, health and fitness quiz, es este que aparece acá. Ese usted lo toma nada más como un ejercicio, es este. Este. Aquí la indicación es qué tan, qué tan saludable y en forma crees que estás. Mm -hmm. Okay. Usted tiene que um, okay. hacer el, el quiz del cero, es bastante insano, in, uh, sí, de 50 es sano. muy sano. Yeah. Entonces usted tiene que, que hacer el quiz en una hojita aparte. Por ejemplo, tratemos de contestarlo. Si tienen un cuadernito ahí, aquí dice, yeah. how many meals do you eat each day? Yo, ¿Cuántas comidas hago? Hago tres comidas, tengo tres puntos. Voy a poner tres puntos para la uno. Porque ah, yo okay. hago tres comidas. Uh -huh. How often do you eat at regular times during the day? How often do you eat at regular oh, times during the day? Ajá, yo casi siempre como regular. Yeah, Entonces yo pongo cinco five. puntos. Cinco puntos para mí. Okay. No sé ustedes si es tres o cero. Mm -hmm. How many servings of fruit or vegetables do you eat each day? Well, ahí me voy a poner quizás. <laughs> None. Cero, None. sí. <laughs> ahí no, no gano punto yo. How sí. much junk food in your eat? Oh, five teacher for you. Mm, very little. Ahí sí, very <laughs> little. Five points. Mm -hmm. uh, do you take vitamins? No, zero, zero. Sometimes. Ok, entonces póngase tres. Veamos qué tengo acá. Which best describe your exercise program? Ah, no hay cero. Which best <laughs> describe no. you? Ah, ok. ¿Y ustedes qué tal? Number What, three. Si hacen peso y entrenamiento y aeróbico, cinco. Si okay. hacen algún tipo de entrenamiento y algo de ejercicio, póngase tres. Okay. How important is your fitness program to you? ¿Qué tan importante mm. es su programa de, de, de entrenamiento? Not no, very important. O sea, no. algo, algo, algo importante. Le voy a poner tres, le voy a dar alguna importancia. Lo ok, your health. No. How often do you get a physical exam? Quizás every two or three years. Otro mm. tres para mí. Now, yes, how often do you sleep well? 
Bueno, yo siempre well, duermo bien, tengo sueño pesado, not, los temores. Not to me. Uh, no, 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 okay. Okay, aquí dice, how often do you exercise or play a sport? <laughs> bueno, never. Pero ahí. Ahora tienen que sumar todo, lo, todo. Sumen. 20. Oh, Ahí tengo tres, ocho. My health and fitness are a little below average. Ay. Me, uh, the, the same because I got 24, tengo 24, entonces caigo aquí. Your yes. health and fitness are a little below average. Below average. Okay. Mm -hmm. What about you, Gloria? ¿Cuántos puntos tiene? Oh, 25, teacher. 25, también estamos aquí. Your health and fitness are a little below average. We are in the, we are in the same club, teacher. Todos, todos estamos en el mismo club. <laughs> Victor. Mm. ¿Ah? How many points? Second. The... Good. 20, 28 to 41. Uh, How many points do you have? Uh -huh. Rebecca, ¿cuántos puntos le dio? 29, teacher. Ah, oh, Rebecca, this is good. Your health and fitness are above average. Congratulations. Yes. <laughs> and you, Guadalupe? ¿Cuántos puntos le dio Guadalupe? El quiz. 25. Ah, 25. Okay. The same so, clue. 25. <coughs> ah, solo Rebeca salió fuera. <laughs> <laughs> Ella es una okay. persona sana. Es una persona fitness. Atlética, fitness. <laughs> Ok, de eso se trataba el ejercicio, nada más hacer como una, así, una okay. survey. No hay que sumitir nada, es solo un ejercicio de, de lectura, de vocabulario, practicando en las preguntas con how. Ok, teacher, gracias. Y con el otro sí nos queda más la plataforma. Ok, and that's it with this Maybe Marvin Ramirez has the correct questions. <laughs> Marvin, le vamos a preguntar a Marvin qué dice. Teacher ya no manda las las presentaciones al grupo. ¿no? Ah, Ayer les mandé el link y les mm. mandé las preguntas. Eh, no hemos hecho PowerPoint hasta ahorita. Eh, mm -hmm. Les puedo mandar el, el link. link y preguntas, pero no es que link estoy en un grupo. En un grupo algo raro y será el mismo. El mismo es. Eh, ¿Me pueden enviar, por favor, este link? Yo ¿Qué pasa? Por que hay mucha video? gente ahí y veo conectados los mismos siempre. Ajá, yo me había conectado a otro grupo y me di cuenta que no era de ese hasta ahora. Ya ha habido un poquito de problema. De hecho, ayer igual alguien estaba escribiendo al chat del grupo de acá y está en el grupo de más noche. Él recibió la clase más noche, pero estaba en el chat de este. Uh -huh. A saber qué pasó ahora, qué pasó, que se confundieron con los grupos y los chats, pero yo les mando el link, ¿sí? Ok. Fisher, ¿cuál es su número? 7398-2774. Sí, ese es. Ah, ese es el grupo entonces, que estoy confundido. Sí, es que yo les escribí anoche, les mandé las preguntas y les mandé el link. Uh -huh. Ah, sí, anoche lo mandó, ya lo vi. Ah, ajá, ahora solo les voy a mandar este link. Para que repasen lo de cómo usar how. Son once, son once a date with you, teacher. ¿Mm? No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No more. No, no dates. Ok. No. Hey, good I night, love teacher. my job. Okay. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.